Prime Minister Dr. Keith Rowley has called out opposition leader Kamala Pesad Bisessa for insisting that Trinidad and Tobago act as mediator between Guyana and Venezuela. At a press conference held earlier today, the Prime Minister addressed the ongoing Guyana Venezuela fight over the Essequibo region. Here's more. Amidst Guyana and Venezuela's ongoing battle over the Essequibo region, Prime Minister Dr. Keith Rowley has called out UNC's political leader, Kamala Posad Bicesa, for wanting Trinidad and Tobago to be a mediator between the two countries. It is very concerning to me that our opposition in Trinidad and Tobago seems to make a career of undermining our national foreign policy or CARICOM policy. Dr. Rowley noted that anyone who wants to pretend to speak about the Guyana-Venezuela situation, asking the government or CARICOM to intervene as mediators, should know that they are going against the position of the people of Guyana. The people of Guyana are firm in their position. I speak to the president on an ongoing basis as a head of CARICOM. This has been in front of us a long time. Guyana does not encourage and does not require its problem to be dealt with by any mediation with Venezuela at this time. The Prime Minister further explained that Guyana places its doors and fortunes in the adjudication of the International Court of Justice. This is their position. However, Venezuela does not recognize this court and that negotiations and dialogues will have to evolve to where they both can meet. For there to be mediation, the parties, that's a requirement of mediation, the parties have to subject themselves to mediation. One person cannot mediate something against somebody else. And I think the opposition should know that and should shut up. Dr. Rowley said all intervening would do is worsen the situation for the people of Guyana. He stated that if support is being shown for Guyana, it can't be shown while verbally undermining what the country believes is its best approach. Ariana Scipio, Tobago Update, Television News.